Spain to keep registry of those who refuse COVID vaccine. Spain is to set up a registry of people who refuse to be vaccinated against coronavirus and share it with other European Union nations, the health minister has said. Salvador Illa said the list would, ma would not be made accessible to the public or to employers. It's just going to be made accessible to the European Union nations, but not to the public or employers. He said the way to defeat the virus was to vaccinate all of us. The more the better. Spain has been one of the countries in Europe worst affected by the virus. It is currently rolling out the Pfizer-BioNTech vaccine, which was approved for EU member states last week. Now, this has been approved by the EU member states, even though we heard the WHO organisation last night on their live media briefing say, two of them said the same, well, one of them said it and another one agreed. The vaccination, there is no proof that not only does the vaccine not protect you, but there is no proof that the vaccine will stop you from then infecting somebody else. So what the point of the vaccine is, only God knows. So those are the two points they came up with yesterday. So the vaccination is not 100% foolproof and you're not protected against, they don't have any evidence to say that you are protected against the virus or indeed that you can then spread the virus. They were also saying on the WHO organisation media briefing, that even if you have had the vaccination, you will still have to quarantine when travelling. Because they still don't know yet if once you've had the vaccine, whether you are protected or whether or not you'll be able to, to in infect anyone else. So, guys, does that make any sense to you? They're rolling out these va this vaccine. Apparently, they want two million people... Um, I can't remember the, the statistics now for the UK, how many they want to get done by next by January. But if they're rushing this thing through and it's not been tested, how can you have a vaccination that is supposed to protect you against something? OK, and then you've got the health, the World Health Organization, the WHO, telling you themselves that there is no evidence to say that the vaccination they are giving to people and that millions have taken already will protect you from anything. And there is also no proof at all to say that it will stop you from infecting other people. That they also told us to get used to it because it's going to be here forever. So what they're injecting people with, only God knows, because it doesn't make any sense to me that they're going to be pushing out, rolling out, forcing out this thing on everybody when the right and the when investigations haven't been done and they can't s tell us whether or not it's safe okay and then you've got places like spain are going to put you on the naughty list if you don't take the vaccination well you know what i know a lot of people that are not going to be taking the vaccination especially now that the health the world health organization has stated that they themselves are unsure of the safe the safety of this vaccination they are unsure of the how efficient the vaccination is going to be because there's been no investigation and there's been no trials with it proper trials with it so what is the point of the vaccination then we must ask ourselves what is the point of it Hopefully this video will be allowed to stay up. Welcome to China 2020. Peace out.